Today, 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 we're supposed to be going to the movies go see Little Mermaid. So with my, well, I'm going with my sister or whatever like that. It's the inner child in this, y'all. We got to see every Disney movie that comes out, okay? Because we've been waiting for Avatar, the way it was to come on Disney Plus for 10 years. After we watched the first one, we was like, oh yeah, we got to see the second one. We got to. But... Yeah, but we be, she's very excited to go see Little Mermaid. Yeah, I don't know why. But it's the inner child in her, I swear. But, um, yeah, we're definitely going to see the Little Mermaid. Have us a little good time. They want to go out to eat. So today, y'all going to come with me. We're actually going to be vlogging my day or whatever. So I'm going to go ahead and hop in the shower. First off, let me tell y'all how she did me so dirty. She woke me up at 11. Knowing that we was going to the movies, she changed the time at the movies because she was like, the tickets gonna be cheap if we go at one or something. Knowing I take 20 years to get ready, why would you, why would you do that? Why would you do that? Now, and they're gonna be fussing and complaining when I'm not ready, but I'm gonna try to be ready in time. Even though I gotta do my natural hair, I gotta vlog. So I hope my natural hair work with me so I won't have to keep redoing it and redoing it and redoing it. So, but that's I'm gonna go hop in the shower and then I get back to y'all when I'm out the shower so I can do my face with you. So, hey y'all, I just got out the shower. So, I'm gonna do my um face routine now. And I'm basically gonna be showing y'all a little bit of what I use. So, I use this, um, I'm confused on what kind of soap it is, but I'll try to put it on the screen right here. Let me move out of the way. And basically, I use this on my face to get it clean or whatever when I start seeing like dark spots or any kind of bumps coming in or whatever. Because I can tell when bumps come in, but that's easy. And then I use this. Um, I'm gonna put a product on the side. So I shouldn't be promoting them because what I ain't getting paid for it. But um, Bio Oil Skincare Oil, I use it when I get like, like I said, dry spots. Anything like that, it just keep my face hydrated after I use that soap. Then, for um, after I get done with all that, you know, I gotta use some cocoa butter, but it's in the stick form, y'all. And I, when I tell you, when I tell y'all, it's the best investment, I put it under my eyes because that's where it mostly dark is under my eyes, on my forehead. That's about it. But yeah, I use that. And then I gotta brush my teeth. So let's go ahead and get into it. Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you said. You said that you would come again. You said that we would remain friends. But you know that I do not depend on nothing or no one. So why would you show up so uninvited? Just change my mind like that. Please don't take this personal But you ain't shit And you ain't special Till I made you so You better act like you know That I've been through worse to you I just can't keep Okay y'all, so I'm back And based on done my skin routine It's a little quick, easy I don't have to do too much Because my skin is not as like it's not bad because the weather and stuff ain't changing. Like my skin gets really bad when the weather's when the weather start like switching up and stuff or the time stamps start changing. But yeah, as y'all can see y'all in a tight as y'all can see. Your skin be looking real hydrated, y'all. What time you in the sun? Y'all gonna be like, oh yeah, her skin is heady. But do that. I just put y'all on, okay? Do that. But best I'm gonna go get ready. Um, I'm gonna try to show y'all my outfit. Uh, I need to clean this stuff up though. 
And also, I want to let y'all know, use white rags on your face only. Like, and this to me, because I'm giving y'all a tip for real, for real. Use only white rags. This the white rag that I use. Use only white rags. Because if you don't, y'all, if you don't use white rags, that, that color, the dye and the rags can mess your face up. So use white rags only. Or if you don't have a white rag or like one of your white rags is dirty use, I recommend gray. Because it doesn't have that much dye in it. It's, it's the closest to white that you will get. Okay? But yeah, I'm best going to do that. And I'm going to show y'all my outfit. And I'm going to come back in here so I can brush my teeth. And then I'm going to put my outfit on and try to do something to my hair. Because y'all y'all don't want to see this head. It looks hot mess. But let's come up in here. So I got a decision between the shorts and the shirt, but let me turn the camera around, y'all. Okay, y'all, so basically this is the shirt that I want to wear. It's brand new. I ain't wore it yet, so I for sure want to wear that. Um, It's been sitting in my drawer for at least a few months, but then we got some light colored jeans or the light colored shorts. I don't know yet. I'm packing the jeans with the little belt thing. Now, the shoes is what I was struggling with because I was like, I want to put in my gray and white ones like those on, um, you know what I'm saying, with the outfit. But then I was like, y'all gonna be like, I don't know how to explain it. But I was like, they just gonna think something weird. So I was like, I'm not gonna do that because everybody know, yeah, I got it. I'm gonna sneak ahead bad. So I gotta come out with it. I want to come out with a new video for y'all which is uh my sneaker haul or whatever but i gotta see when i'm gonna do that video i definitely want to do it for sure so i'm gonna do it soon for y'all but basically this is what i'm kind of going with the purple thing i don't know yet because i got a white purse that can also go with these outfits so we're just gonna see how this gonna work out but i'm gonna get back to y'all i'm gonna go brush my teeth and i'll show y'all that but no, I kind of want to show y'all that because that's kind of nasty. I hate when people blog and they be brushing their teeth. But I'm going to show y'all little clippies of me brushing my teeth so y'all know I brush my teeth. Okay? Okay, y'all. Okay, so right now I'm recording off my main phone. So I got my backup phone. That's a trick. y'all. I'm going to turn the camera around. Y'all see how this phone don't work. It only works on Wi Fi because it's yeah. Take it off my plane. Uh -uh. But y'all see that? Like, that, that, that is ratchet. You know? I don't know how I dropped it, but I did. And it just messed up the whole screen. Don't mind that photo. That photo is ugly. But it's um 1222. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. I'm supposed to be back down there at 1230. What am I doing? Y'all. I'm finna be left. Oh, Lord. I'm finna to be left, y'all. Let me just speed through this. Um, so I can get that. But I'm basically gonna get back to y'all after I get done put my clothes on because I'm running behind, like running behind bed. So y'all, we done made it to the movies. Hey, hey. So I don't know if I'm supposed to be recording here, but I snuck my tripod in here. So yeah, I'm gonna get to y'all when we get into the movie there, so we won't miss the movie.
we don't let the movies say out of 10 out of 10. Definitely recommend what you think. 10 out of 10. Yes, 10 out of 10. <laughs> definitely recommend. We're gonna go try to find something to eat because we're hungry. So yeah, I'll get back to y'all when we get to our final destination. Oh so, y'all, we done made it to Zaxby's and this is what we eating. I got the big Zach snack. I'm pretty sure Nene got the same thing. It's still, but she just got two toasts at it. And I'm basically just we're gonna grow up down. And I'm supposed to be going with my friend later on, so I might vlog a little bit of that. I'm supposed to be going to this LA City thing. So I might vlog a little bit of that, but if I don't, that's okay because I got enough minutes on my vlog for y'all to enjoy it. So basically we're gonna grow up down and I'll give it to y'all when we get done. Say hey to the vlog. Say hey to the vlog. <laughs> but y'all done made it to Nikki house with to camp here. Be no, doing a lot of I'm not gonna put that okay. camera on you. <laughs> but I've been doing a lot of running around. I had to go home, go get some bathing suits. We just decided to go to the pool. Mm -mm. We just decided to go to the pool or whatever because why not? Pool day, pool day. <laughs> pool day, pool day. So I'll record a little bit of that when we get there. So I'll get back to y'all, yo. This this one got us lost. This one got us lost. I ain't, I ain't never been down here, so I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> she just the destination driver. So God, this stuff is cold. It's not that bad no more. Yeah. This stuff is all good. This is a white lady go to us. like, are y'all with the owner? And you're like, yes. I said, my friend up the street. You're talking to well, yeah, don't have only, access down. I'm like, the only guy be right. Like, you're pool. not in the pool. Why are you worried about oh, us God. being in the pool? Damn, they so lit. Oh God, they lit. Y'all, that's the tube I was on. Anyways, we're gonna go. We're going to the main we're pool because she, because she tripping. Okay. Oh, got kicked out again. But I'm so glad because this time we'll actually already finna leave. It's right by her house. Alright, so show me myself for real like i've been live like i'm telling y'all i've been living my life these past few weekends i really been trying i think it's more of me trying to get out the house more because of the event that i went through i was really stuck in the house really depressed and stuff so i've been trying to get out the house more trying to get over my fears and stuff like that so that's staying with my friends staying with people that i love people that i feel safe with is really helping me get back into my old self but i finally done made it home and y'all we got kicked out of two pools and the police called on this no i don't know why i y'all know why but you know what i'm saying it just it's ridiculous because they shouldn't kick us out no pool just because of what we look like you feel me so let me just tell y'all. So the first pool we went to, we was chilling. We was in there for a good maybe 15 minutes. White lady came out there. No offense to the people that watch me that are white. I love y'all. Y'all are not the problem. It's them. Those type of people are the problem. So a white lady came out there and she was just like, um, she was like, are y'all the owner here? With that attitude now, y'all, mind you, we was real respectful to this woman because we was like, we're not trying to get kicked out of here, blah, blah, blah. 
so we was like, um, yeah, Hayden had told her, like, yeah, we with Sarah Lynn. You know what I'm saying? That's her friend. She live up there. So the woman was like, well, that has nothing to do with this property over here. Tell us some, um, so if you're not an owner over here, y'all need to leave this pool. So we're looking at her like, girl, you're not over this pool. You're not even, why come and bother us knowing we're not doing anything to y'all? We were literally sitting in the pool enjoying ourselves. Literally, we wasn't being loud. We wasn't making the disturbance. I see if we were doing that. But y'all, we was not even being loud, making no disturbance. We was chilling, like, literally chilling. And as y'all can see in the vlog, y'all can sleep. We was chilling because the water was too cold to be doing all that moving, yelling, screaming, dipping in the pool, all that. The water was too cold to be doing that in that pool. So after she said that, we were kind of complaining a little bit. But it was like, y'all, let's just let it go. Let's go to the pool up there. Okay. Went to the other pool up there. We got in the pool, whatever. So, Cause the first pool that we went into, the gate was unlocked. So we went on here and just went in. We didn't think nothing of it. We just like, okay, okay, let's just go in. That was a private pool now. We probably what, shouldn't have been there, but it's like we wasn't making no disturbance. So why even come and bother us? Now the second pool that we went to was the beach pool. We didn't end up going to the beach pool we was sent to, but we got interrupted. So basically, we went to the beach pool. We was chilling out there. Like, y'all, we was literally out there for forever. Like, we was finna go to the, like, the beach part of the pool. So we was just chilling. So we was walking out the gate or whatever. And it was a whole bunch of, I said we was by ourselves. Then it was a whole bunch of white kids and white adults that came into the pool when we was finna get ready to leave. So we got our stuff. We got ready to leave. So we was walking out the entrance. And he came to the, um, the thing. And he was like, first off, when we got there, when we got there and them folks seen us get out the car, they was like looking at us, giving us that look like, why are y'all here? Like that type of look just because of what we look like. So it was kind of already racist at that point, but we wasn't really stunning because we were here to enjoy ourselves. We we're not stunning y'all. So after that, we was trying to get ready to leave. And this man was like, mind you, this pool needed, you needed a wristband. Mind you, none of these folks in this pool that were white had a wristband, none none of them had a wristband so he comes to the gate comes to him, so do y'all have a wristband well if y'all don't have a wristband y'all need to leave so we're looking at him like but all these other people don't have no wristband and that's how i know he didn't check and ask them other people did they have a wristband i bet they still was in that pool we was walking out everybody was just staring at us blah 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 we went out we could see him turning the corner before us like he was already out there before us so that means you didn't you didn't even get a chance to go ask them folks you stood at that gate until we went around that corner, then you left. So that tells me another thing. You didn't want us in that pool, but you allowed them to be in that pool because of their skin color. Like, y'all see what I'm saying? So it was really just a bad experience at that point. But we was enjoying ourselves, so I'm not really tripping about that. So then, that's when we got on the golf cart with Sarah then and Bo. So, basically, after we got out of the golf cart with them, we was basically just riding around, having fun, like y'all gonna see, like, we almost flipped over a bunch of times, but we was having our fun or whatever. Next thing we know, we went up to the main pool so that we can tell Hayden Cousin to park right there until we get back. Mind you, the main pool is the open pool. Anybody can be in that pool. It doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter. You can be in that pool regardless. You can be in that pool regardless. You don't need the owner with you. You don't need nobody with you. We went up there. We see the police. So at this point, we're like, what the world? We like, stay calm, y'all. Stay calm. Because you know how it is with us. I feel like he would have did something even worse if it wasn't. Like he, I feel like he would have been more meaner if we didn't have sailing and bubble with us. If y'all feel what I'm saying. But we was there. We was just like, stay calm, y'all. So he pulled up behind Hayden Cousin's car. So he was just like... Um, I've been hearing a lot of complaints about y'all in private pools. I just feel like y'all need to stay out of private pools. Y'all can't go back in them. So, we like, okay, so now these folks gonna kick us out the pool when we was not disturbing them. Now they don't call the police on us. For what? It doesn't make no sense. So, after they called the police on us, he came on there, he was talking to us, and he was like, y'all can't even get in this pool, which was the main pool deck anybody can get in he was like y'all can't even get in this pool so we're looking at him like why we can't get in this pool when we first off even if it wasn't public whatever 
if we will stand with Sarah Lynn and she the owner, she can get in that pool and we can get in there with her because we're guests of her. You feel what I'm saying? Because Hayden was telling me, she was like, I be going to the pool, the private pools with um, Sarah Lynn all the time, but it just be me and her. Obviously, they're not going to say nothing because she was like, obviously, they're not going to say nothing because, you know what I'm saying, I'm with a white person. So, basically, after that altercation, we were just going down the trail, and he was basically following Hayden's sister to make sure we wasn't, she wasn't part nowhere, that she wasn't supposed to be part. Like, he was just spying on her, and he went up and left her, and he went to go make sure we wasn't in no other pool. He was telling us we can't get in no pool. Don't matter if it's the main one, if we were the owner, we can't get in no pool. So, now we think of, like, what like come on dude y'all ruin the fun for kids it's ain't like we up here we boys we got hella bags on us like we ain't got nothing on us like we're literally chilling we got a towel in our bathing suit the bags was in the car so how is we disturbing y'all nobody was around us when we was at these pools either so how would we be disturbing y'all y'all just looking at us the type of way because of our skin tone so that was kind of a racist experience but we took it, we handled it good. You know what I'm saying? We're not gonna show out like all these other people and then they call us ratchet, ghetto, da da da. We didn't show out because that's just not us. We don't do that. We're not gonna make no scene for y'all to take us to jail, for y'all to say we cause promotion. So we not finna make it seem like y'all not finna just turn that on it. So we just went on ahead and lived after that. After we got out the trail, we just went on ahead and got in the car and lived. Because they had ruined our whole mood. But we had fun though, so I can look past that. It's always going to be them people that act like that. Anybody, don't matter what skin color they is, they're, people like that are going to act like that. They got that in their blood. Simple as that. They was raised like that. They're going to act like that. But other than that, we enjoyed ourselves. So if y'all don't mind, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if y'all haven't already. And I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Bye. And y'all know we coming with bangers. At the bangers, at the bangers, at the bangers, back, the back, the back, the back. All right, bye, y'all.